Hi, I'm Marianne Bruns. I'm Minster High School's biology and anatomy and physiology teacher. And I've had a lot of questions about the COVID-19 virus and the vaccine and how it works. So I thought I would explain to you guys uh, how this vaccine is supposed to work, just like I explained it to my students. So up here, I have the SARS-CoV-2 virus, a very detailed drawing. Um, this is also known as the COVID-19 virus. What you'll notice about this virus is it's got lots of different colored things on the outside. Those are different proteins. The virus uses those proteins to do different stuff. Each one of these proteins, the instructions to make it come from this little piece of RNA inside. So the yellow protein, the instructions are on the yellow RNA. The red protein, the instructions are on the red RNA. Now the blue protein here, this is what we're going to talk about. This is that spike protein you may have heard on the news. So the instructions to make this spike protein are found on this blue piece of RNA. RNA is like a simple version of DNA. It's kind of the same. What scientists know is that the spike protein really gets your immune system fired up. So what they've done is they've taken this one piece of RNA out of the SARS-CoV-2 virus. Just one piece. So we've got the instructions here to make one protein. It's to make the spike protein. I tell the students, this is like if I took a little piece of what's left of Mr. Kaler's hair and I hold it up and I said, hey guys, is this Mr. Kaler? Students are like, no, that's not Mr. Kaler. That's just a piece of his rare hair. This is not the COVID-19 virus. This is just a tiny little piece of it. So what scientists have done is taken these spike protein instructions and put them in a lipid droplet because your cells are made of lipids. And then they take that, and that's what the vaccine is, and they inject that into your muscle cells. So this thing is supposed to be a muscle cell. Your muscle cell gets these little instructions, and your muscle cell reads them and is like, all right, I'll make the spike protein. So your muscle cell actually starts to kick out spike protein. Not the COVID virus, just the protein. So your muscle cells start making all of these little proteins, just the little spike proteins, and when you do that, your immune system sees these spike proteins and your immune system's like, whoa, those are not from you. And your immune system starts to have a response. At the end of that response, you make antibodies to the spike protein. That way, if you actually get infected with the real virus, your immune system says, hey, I've seen these spike proteins before. I know what to do with them. I know how to fight them and I know how to kill this and then you don't actually get sick. That's how an immunization works. I tell the students, it's kind of like if you're going to play another team in sports, and before you play them, you watch film of how that team plays. That way, when you actually get on the court with them, you know what they're gonna do. So getting this immunization is kind of like watching the film of the COVID-19 virus. Your body knows what to do, and that's how it works. Pretty simple stuff. Thanks for listening.